It's been five months since authorities found Hanya Aguilar's body. While her family waits for justice, they're celebrating her life. Thursday would have been Hanya's 14th birthday. It's also, also the first time Hanya's mother has spoken publicly since her daughter disappeared. CBS 17's Zach Dahlheimer shares her story. The search for Hanya Aguilar caught the attention of people living all around North Carolina and across the country. And today, people fill Luther Britt Park to honor Hanya and to celebrate what would be her 14th birthday. Happy birthday to you. She's not here with us, but she turned 14 in heaven. For Elizabeth Ortiz Garcia, she's still coping with her best friend, Hanya Aguilar, now gone. She didn't deserve this. She was a sweet girl. We all of us miss her, her friends, her teacher, her teachers, especially her mom. <laughs> but Hanya's family, friends, and people throughout the community came out to celebrate her with cake, cards, Three! and balloons. They know that Hanya's getting these balloons up in heaven. All in a sea of Hanya's favorite color, purple. I am happy and sad too because I wish she was here cutting her own cake. Some days we have sad days, some days we have happy days. Lumberton police even presenting Hanya's mother, Selza Hernandez, with a card and portrait of her daughter. While Hernandez has mixed feelings, she says she's thankful for those around her. Yo creo que es las personas, el apoyo de las personas. I believe the support of all the people people eh, desde el principio me apoyaron mucho from the beginning everybody support y me siguen apoyando they keep supporting me de diferentes maneras the different in different ways primero dios me hace fuerte God makes me strong. Luego saber que mi comunidad está conmigo. And then knowing that my community is with me. Hernandez says these last few months have been tough on her family, but she'll keep standing up for her daughter. Bastante difícil. Very difficult. Eh, muy cansado. Tired. Pero voy a seguir luchando por la justicia de mi hija. But I will keep working hard for justice for my daughter. In Lumberton, Zach Dahlheimer, CBS 17 News.